everyone, I'm Diana Bakken and I am the founder and director of Warrior Dog Rescue. We started about six weeks ago. This rescue is brand new and we are off to the races with a couple different stories I'm gonna share with you. We have met some really amazing organizations across the country who have reached out to us for help. And so we are bringing dogs in from Missouri and different dogs in from Alabama and it's been a very fun ride so far and we're just getting going. About a couple weeks ago, Hannah and I went down to Missouri on an educational trip to meet some people and to learn about the situation they have going down there in Texas County. The overpopulation is completely out of control and we have partnered with a group down there that is called the Barking Bridge Project and they are trying to help control the overpopulation by offering discounted spays and neuters in the county. When we were on this weekend trip, we came across a dog. This is Journey, Journey Lou, and Journey Lou was chained to a tree and it was breaking our hearts we um, didn't know what we could do about it she was very evidently clearly due to give birth any day and our hearts were broken as to what we could do to help her we through a lot of deliberation and a lot of planning we were able to convince the owners to give her up to us. So with a very small fee, um, we brought Journey Lou back to Minnesota. Less than 24 hours, she gave birth to eight beautiful babies. One of them is not eating well and is not growing as well as the rest of them are. And so we're contemplating whether or not we need to discuss a feeding tube or what we need to do to help little Rala grow. Um, we have exhausted all of our other efforts and so the feeding tube is the next thing that we may have to do. And of course, for a feeding tube, we need funds for that. But Journey's story is just one of many stories that we have come across. We were able to help her and, and her babies. They would have never survived chain to that tree. So, we then partnered with a group down in Alabama, and we have five or six, as of right now, maybe it'll be more by the time the transport comes in a couple of weeks, um, dogs that will be coming up that are strays or abandoned down there that are amazing dogs, and they're going to find their place in um, foster homes here and then be adopted. Um, so it's going to be a really exciting thing and we're just getting going. Um, we're small, we are tiny, but we've got an amazing group of fosters, an amazing leadership team, an amazing board of directors. We are focused and we know what our vision is and I'm just asking if you guys want to come alongside of us, go on this journey with us so that um, we can save more dogs just like Journey and her babies. We only know the beginning of their story and we want to create their story, end their story with a really good ending with a good new adoptive home.